We cover terrorism as a topic in social studies, and a lot of the time terrorism is associated with Islam. How can we help people understand that terrorism does not originate from a religion, but mostly political agendas? You see, Islamic teachings has nothing to do with terrorism. Allah Ta'ala says very clearly, categorically in the Holy Quran, that the killing of a person is akin to the killing, killing of the whole of mankind. And saving a life of one person is as you have saved the life of the whole of the mankind. Right? Then Holy Quran says that killing a person without reason will t take you to the hell. Right? The Holy Quran says killing a believer will uh, lead you to go to hell. What Muslims are doing? Muslims are killing each other. So all those who are killing each other, according to the teaching of the Holy Quran and according to the narrations of the Holy Prophet وسلم, they will go to hell. And then Islam says that to spread Islam, you should not use sword. Even when the first commandment of fighting back the enemies of Islam was given in the, in the Surah Hajj, and that clearly says that you have been granted permission to fight back, to retaliate these enemies of Islam, because if now you leave them, to do whatever they like, then you will not see any religion on the face of the earth. So you will not see any synagogue, any church, any temple, or any mosque intact. So here where the permission is given to fight back is not to save Islam or to spread Islam, but to save the religion. And that is Judaism, Christianity, or and other, other religions. So it is written in the Holy Quran. Allah Ta'ala says, there will not be any synagogue, any church, any temple, and then at the end, says any mosque, if you did not retaliate. So that shows Islam is not a militant religion. Rather, it protects the religion. It is against the terrorism. It is against extremism. Whatever the present day people are doing in the name of Islam, they are actually defaming the name of Islam. They are trying to misinterpret the, inter the, the verses of the Holy Quran in their favor. That the jihad is uh, uh, permitted and uh, very much important in Islam. What type of jihad they are doing? Allah Ta'ala says, if you, a believer kills a believer, he will go to hell. So here, in the extremism, we, we see these people, those who are uh, terrorists or extremists, they are fighting with each other in the Muslim countries. Here you will see very rare cases in the Europe, where they come and kill some non-Muslim. But in Muslim countries, they are killing each other. And it means they are making their place in hell, not in the paradise. As I have already said, Islam protects all the religion and it has nothing to do with extremism or terrorism or destroying other religions or spreading the message of Islam with salt. Okay? Understand or not? Yes. Right? Okay. Job. Exactly.